I have to mention something for all audiences. It's a bit of life advice that my life has taught me. I was a judoka mm-hmm. when I was a teenager. Mm-hmm. Had some bad shoulder injuries on both my shoulders. Rotator cuff stone before the age of sixteen. Wow! So my first mm-hmm. surgery, in my, so my first surgery in my life was when I was fifteen or sixteen years old. Mm-hmm. Second surgery was when I was seventeen years old, okay. and they were on either of my rotator cuffs because I started getting problems. Like it would just get dislocated by itself. Wow! Okay. Um, I think those were pretty bad tears, mm-hmm. and uh, perhaps the surgery was justified in those cases. but i think that with a lot of these bad injuries that one gets in sports mm-hmm. you really have to gauge how bad the tear is and um don't immediately jump into getting a surgery because i feel it is a very long process when it comes to recovery like i think my shoulders have gotten okay only now and i'm 31 years old right 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 you no know, yeah. years yeah. of physio years of waiting years yeah. of yoga finally fixed it right so i feel really bad about getting the surgery even if i needed it back then yeah uh also we have technologies like stem cells in the modern day yeah um we have better and better physiotherapy access in india as well yeah. go to a great sports physio don't jump into getting a surgery immediately exactly yeah we have a lot of wellness modalities uh, treatment modalities physical therapists are you know excellent these days I and mean, they can get you back into the right mechanics uh, um so definitely uh, if you can avoid you avoid the surgery now you have reason to avoid and you have you have uh, things that can easily heal it yeah. um so so that's the first line of uh, treatment anyhow only in a situation very refractory to all these things or it's a complete tear then you would need yeah. surgery like yeah. my acl tear i think it's a grade 2 or grade 3 mm-hmm. there's four grades four is like completely torn yes yeah. grade 1 is a tiny tear mine was two right right um yeah. there was a lot of people who suggested surgery yeah like the the first impulse was oh shit you tore your acl you have to get a surgery yeah. so that first couple of weeks of tearing my acl was psychologically annoying for me exactly I'm like yeah. why should i get a surgery so fast yeah. let me see what's happening um i'm fine right now i'm getting yeah, better, better gradually yeah, yeah. i'm coming to your office tomorrow yeah yeah, yeah <laughs> absolutely there's a reason for that so you know a big guy like you get the recommendation of surgery imagine like you know anybody can so why why that recommendation has been given to you surgery because number one um India as a heavily we are a surgery orient people think orthopedics means surgery right that's all orthopedic means surgery so and and it's heavily surgery focused nation because we do more orthopedic surgeries than orthopedic treatments like in western world like in us um yeah there was a lot of surgeries 10 15 years ago but if you look at the last 10 15 years there's a lot of regenerative procedures and less surgeries mm. surgery is always the last resort so it is normal to get a recommendation because when somebody does surgery all the time yeah we used to do surgery for that okay let's go do surgery but the newer technologies like what we're talking are coming in now and they're not enough experts that can do it like the interventional orthopedics i think it will change i think it will change because more and more guys like me you know incorporating this people know like where to go and where to get it done but now it's lack of choices they feel like okay when you go to a surgeon okay let's do surgery because there's nothing else they think but if there's a specialist that can do you know biologics like what we do um uh, people will um that shift will happen and orthopedics also will accept that because for the betterment of the patient hey when you don't need surgery unnecessarily you don't need it when you are stage 4 yes i would do surgery so that's happening we are at the logger heads of that junction of that uh, transition of the of the orthopedics right now if you enjoyed today's clip make sure you check out these curated playlists that we've made especially for you related to the subject that was spoken about in this clip